Governor Greg Abbott held a border security summit to announce new initiatives, but one in particular is getting all the attention. Hello, everybody. I'm Heather Hayes. And I'm Blake Hansen. Governor Abbott says he plans to build a wall on the Texas border with Mexico, though details are lacking. He also says he's forming a task force to meet every two weeks to evaluate and improve security plans. And he says law enforcement will begin arresting illegal immigrants for trespassing on private property. Fox News Macy Jenkins has more on the security plan. Macy. Well, Heather and Blake, Governor Abbott addressed a range of issues down at the border today, including everything from the impact of illegal immigration on landowners, farm owner, farm, farmers, rather, and law enforcement agencies to expanding local jail capacity ahead of a serious crackdown. I will announce next week the plan for the state of Texas to begin building the border wall in the state of Texas. A bombshell announcement from Governor Greg Abbott at Thursday's Border Security Summit in Del Rio. New plans for border construction and new barriers. The governor did not provide details on the wall's expected cost, location, or when construction may begin. Those details could come with next week's announcement. President Biden stopped construction of the Trump administration's border wall program when he took office. Governor Abbott also announced a comprehensive crackdown on illegal crossings. We don't want just to arrest somebody to have them released. We want to arrest somebody, to have them prosecuted, to be put in jail, to stay in jail, to create an environment where people will choose. They don't want to come across the border in the state of Texas anymore because it's not what they were expecting. His announcement just a day after U.S. Customs and Border Protection released its May statistics. More than 180,000 illegal immigrants or asylum seekers apprehended. The highest number in the month of May in 20 years. It is out of control and a change is needed. Part of the governor's updated plan includes $1 billion in security measures, including more boats, drones, and manpower for DPS troopers deployed along the border. He also continued his ongoing attack on the Biden-Harris administration over what he calls its open border policies. It's not the red carpet that the federal administration rolled out to them. Thursday's summit comes just days after Vice President Kamala Harris took her first international trip since taking office, visiting Mexico and its southern border country, Guatemala. You can't say you care about the border without caring about the root causes. Harris insisting on a holistic approach to combating illegal immigration, including programs incentivizing citizens to stay in their countries and addressing corruption throughout Central America. Earlier this week, the White House acknowledged the administration is still working to improve asylum processing at the border. Meanwhile, Governor Abbott is focused on his joint partnership with several state agencies, including the AG's office and Department of Public Safety, and a task force to discuss ongoing border solutions. We are going to do everything we can to secure the border, and it begins immediately today right here in Val Verde County. Abbott also discussed a partnership with the state of Arizona and urged other states to work along with Texas to combat illegal immigration from a united front.